Hi everybody, it's Adam with heartvalvesurgery.com and we're in San Antonio at the annual meeting of the Society of Thoracic Surgeons. I am thrilled to be joined by Dr. Doug Johnston, who is the Chief of Cardiac Surgery at Northwestern Medicine in Chicago, Illinois. Dr. Johnson, you and I have known each other for a long time. It is great to see you again. Great to see you, Adam. Yeah, so we're here at STS. We're learning a lot, seeing some great presentations. We're also getting patient questions coming in from around the world. This question came in from Sabate, and Sabate asks, what are the survival rates of minimally invasive versus sternotomy for heart valve therapy? Well, Sabate, excellent question. This is something that comes up a lot. Patients may hear, depending on who they talk to, concerns about minimally invasive surgery that it is less effective or less safe. And the way I would answer that is we now have many studies from large centers that do both sternotomy and small incision surgery that show us that the safety is equivalent, meaning that your chance of making it through the operation, freedom from mortality, is the same. We don't have as much data about long-term survival, but what we know is if you had a, a good early operation, you get a good valve, your long-term survival is dependent more on your heart and your other disease processes, whatever else is going on with you. So we expect that that long-term outcome will be the same. Um, it's important to talk to somebody who does minimally invasive surgery if you wanna find out about minimally invasive surgery. So um, I, I think that patients' best source of information on these are to get a couple of opinions from people who do different types of operations so they can really understand that this is, to some extent, an expert consensus, but there is very good data to support both. Well, Dr. Johnson, that is great advice. And Sabate, hey, I hope that helped you. I know it helped me. And Dr. Johnson, as always, thanks to you and your entire team at Northwestern Medicine for all the great work that you're doing. Thanks for being with me thanks today. Thanks a lot, Adam. Hi everybody, it's Adam. I hope you enjoyed that video. And don't forget, you can always subscribe to our YouTube channel. Watch the next two educational videos coming up on your screen or click the blue button to visit heartvalvesurgery.com.